Hey what's up guys I'm here and this is the Redmi Note 4. So just a couple of days ago I made a video about how to unlock the bootloader, root the device and how to install the TWRP recovery. And later I made a video about how to install Resurrection Remix ROM which is a custom ROM and which is based on Android Nougat 7.1.2. So you can see I am currently running that custom ROM but many of you asking me how to install a stock ROM and want a video of that so this is the video of how to install stock ROM in the Redmi Note 4. So there are two stock ROMs developer ROM and the stable one. I will talk about that later on so first of all uh, let's understand that I will suggest you to clean up all the data while installing the stock ROM so make sure to back up of your all the data means photos videos in your PC and you can use these quick settings to go to the bootloader directly and if you don't have you can use the key combination by simply power of the device hold the volume down and power key for about 2 to 3 seconds and you will see the fastwood mode and now open the web browser in your PC and go to en.miui.com and after that just go to downloads and in that you need to select your device name Redmi Note 4 so I'm specially making this video for the Redmi Note 4 but if you want to install the stock ROM in Redmi Note 3 then you can follow the same procedure but you need to select the Redmi Note 3 and there are so many devices which has the same procedure so you can follow this but I'm talking about the Redmi Note 4 in this video so there are three different variants of the Redmi Note 4 first one is the MediaTek Global second is the Qualcomm Global and third one is the MediaTek China so in India most people have the Qualcomm one so select your device according to the variant and now select that so my device is based on snapdragon processor which is a qualcomm one and i'm selecting that and on the left side there are two options stable and developer rom so if you want a rom without any bugs and issue then you can download that but you will get marshmallow in that but if you want to install the android nougat but also daily updates you will get new features before other users then you can download the developer rom but the bugs will be more in this rom so after that just click on flashing guide and on the left side click on fast boot update and now time to download the flashing tool so download so click on this mi rom flashing tool and download that i have already downloaded that so i am not downloading it again and here is the mi flash tool now time to download the stock rom for the redmi note 4 so there are again so many devices over here so download the stock rom for the redmi note 4 so you can see there are again so many variants like developer stable and in the developer and stable there are for mediatek china mediatek global and qualcomm global so download according to that i will download the developer one because i will install the android nougat rom and uh, select the qualcomm latest global stable or download the qualcomm latest developer rom so i will download the developer one so click on that so i have already downloaded that i am now downloading it again and after that just extract this zip file and after extracting this you will get this file so you need to rename this file and just add dot zip at the end of this name and now you need to extract this zip file again and after extracting you will get these files these are the image file of the stock rom and you can delete this zip file if you want to now you need to just copy this file means the folder or you can cut this folder and paste outside all the folders on your drive means the root directory you can copy this and paste in the local disk c local disk d local disk e etc so i am pasting this in local disk d so just paste this stock rom like this and now time to install the mi flashing tool and now install this and see the location where it is installing because we need to go to that place too so just install this click on next next and install and after installation just go to that location so it has been installed in local disk c so just go to there and here is the xiaomi folder and the xiaomi flash just open this flash tool and after that just click on refresh and your device will be detected if your device is not detected then you need to install the drivers so search on the google how you can install the driver of your device it's very simple now click on select and then browse the rom folder and i have pasted in front of you 
earlier so I will browse that folder over here and click on OK and you can click on refresh again to see whether our device has been connected or not so there are three different options first is the clean all second is the save user data and third is the clean all and lock so I suggest you to go to the first one clean all it will erase the data and also the bootloader will remain unlocked and click on flash to flash the stock ROM. If you save the user data then you will face so many issues, software issues, bugs etc. So I will suggest you to go for the clean all. And don't lock the bootloader your warranty will not void. And if you want to root the device or install the custom ROM later on then no need to unlock the bootloader again. It will take about 7 to 10 minutes and after that your device will automatically get reboot. And here it is you can remove the USB cable and you can see the MIUI 8 setup wizard. And now you can set up the wizard and do all your things and set up your account etc. So this is all about the installation of the stock ROM in the Redmi Note 4. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this video then hit the like button and also subscribe the channel for more videos. And if you face any type of queries and problems regarding this video or installation of stock ROM then you can post your comment in the comment section. And I will see you guys soon in my next video.